Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Prisma. Today we are going to solve one of the issue that is Prisma needs to perform transactions which requires your MongoDB server to be run as a replica set. To how to solve this issue we are going to learn in this video. Those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel and if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. So let's get started. So first of all, we have to create the replica set in the MongoDB. Otherwise, the Prisma will not work. So what we have to do, I have already run the statements over here. So replication, the replica said that means by default, the replication is not enabled into your MongoDB con file. So you have to enable it. How you can enable it? Okay. So go to the terminal. Okay. So here, first of all, you have to write the following commands. Okay. So this is the basically I have added currently. Like, uh, first of all, we have to check the path where the con file is located so you need to add db admin command cmd command line options if you haven't watched my how to find the mongodb con files you can watch my video in the linux playlist you will get to know about this one db admin command get command line options so you will get it over here the path of that mongodb that is etc mongodb con so you get to know about this one okay after this what we have to do you have to get the <coughs> rs initiate the replica set Okay, so after you getting the this path, you have to open that file. Okay, so here you can see that I have already created the replica file, right? So for this one, you have to open now after getting know the con file, what we have to do, go with the nano or pseudo nano. Okay, nano, then con file that is etc, then mongo db con open this file by adding the password over here done after this there is a replication statement okay here you can see the replication so here i have add the replica set name by my replica set over here right this you have to add then con then control a control o control a then control x okay after doing this you have to add this command this command rs initiate my replica set members host this so after adding this okay you can see this i have added this one right the members and it, it will reply with the okay one so make sure you have to add this lines okay my replica set so i have already already mentioned this one this line so you need to add this line after this you need to check the rs status with this one and now you will after doing this this that line this line you have to add then rs status nothing else then exit okay after doing this okay so when i try to run this command and now we are going to currently this is my collection right so let me drop this database okay now try to insert a record over here so let me go to my this one now i'm going to add with migrate uh, here generate first prisma then i go with the db push so it will create the db so here we go with this one with the db let's refresh this one okay so here we have a Prisma MongoDB with the collection user is added now. Moving to the next, let's create the user with the node server.js. So node server.js. Okay. So here you can see the user is created now. Now the issue is not coming up. And if I go over here with the collection, refresh and go with the view document, you can see the one object ID is created with example this one. So this is how you can connect the prisma i will give you another tutorial for how to connect to the mongo with prisma with the, all the codes and stuff but make sure you have to watch all these videos to get into working with that one okay so thank you so much for watching this video and don't forget to like share and comment on my video have a nice day